Hey everybody, it's Dusty from Dusty Beards again. Today I want to talk about something a little different, tea tree oil. I know that sounds weird, but if you read your ingredients on your bottles, you have that in a lot of your uh, a lot of your mixes for beard oils, some of your uh, beard balms and butters, other products too. Uh, so I want to talk about the benefits and some of the not so benefit sides to that oil. So stay tuned and we'll be right back. So as I stated, tea tree oil has a lot of benefits. It's antifungal, antiviral, antibacterial, has a lot of good things going on. However, there are some things that you may think it's gonna do that it's not gonna do. So let's talk about the benefits first. Benefits to it is it cleans the hair follicle, softens the hair. It's really good if you have dandruff. You know, I've got sensitive skin, I don't have dandruff. I actually have what they call seborrheic dermatitis. It's the opposite of dandruff, different chemical imbalance. but it really helps with the flakes. It really, really helps with the flakes. It's very soothing. Like if, you, if you've if you ever used like a tea tree shampoo and conditioner, you get that real cold burst on your skin. That's coming from the tea tree oil. It's doing its job and it is amazing. It, like I said, it has really good benefits, but you can't use it. Like if you look up a site, you look up any information and, and you wanna know how you kill coronavirus, since that's what we're going through right now. They recommend that it's not gonna kill that virus. Vinegar is not gonna kill that virus. It's a very good cleaner. You know, like if you wanna make up a cleaner to, to scrub your tub or your sink or your kitchen or whatever, it's really good for that. But it's not made for a, a, a do-all. It's not made for a coronavirus killer or a flu killer. Um, I'll, I'll post a link below, you can read up on that. But, and I'll also post a link on the benefits of it. Like I said, it's, it'll really soften the hair um, you can mix it up with different things. It's a very strong scented oil. Um, you can mix it with other things like they do. So if you read your beard ingredients on your bottles, it'll tell you a lot of the times that there's some sort of tea tree oil in it. Um, it's not gonna be alone. It's not gonna be the only essential oil in there. You're gonna have to put other things with it. Otherwise you're gonna have a really strong, not so pleasant smell. So they'll put a few drops in the in the uh, carrier oil, the base of the, the beard oil. They'll put a few drops in there with a few other things to balance that smell out, give you a good scent, and you're good to go. But it's working, it's still doing its job. It's gonna get down to that follicle, it's gonna clean it, it's gonna strengthen it, it's gonna soften up the hair, it's gonna do what it's made to do. But just because you put that in your beard doesn't mean that, oh, well now I won't get coronavirus because my beard's gonna catch it all and the tea tree's gonna kill it. And you guys, I know that sounds crazy, but I read a post the other day, and I'm not gonna call the person out, I'm not that kind of guy, but I read a post the other day that this guy said, I'm just gonna put tea tree oil in my beard and I'll never catch coronavirus. And in the picture, he is literally, he's got a bottle in his hand and he's pouring it in his palm, and in the next picture, he's rubbing it all over his face. I have seen some of the weirdest things with, with people with beards that they have no idea what they're doing with them. I saw another one, this dude just coated it all with mayonnaise and wrapped it up with saran wrap. Why? Why are you doing that to your face? Why are you doing that to your hair on your face? Why are you doing that to your beard and your mustache, your goatee, if that's all you've got? You, you've got you've to educate yourselves, and that's what I want to do here. I want to try to teach you guys some things. Uh, you ladies, you can show your guys and say, hey, you need to be taking care of your beard. You need to soften it up. If, if you can take it and just play with it, and the guy's not complaining, He's, I mean, the, that follicle strengthened up, his skin is his healthy, his hair's healthy, it's not gonna bother him. If he leaves it dry and you go to play with it and pull on it, it's gonna hurt, he's gonna complain, he's gonna whine. You've got to take care of your beards. So don't think that just because you get some sort of thing that says, oh, well, tea tree oil's disinfectant, it's gonna kill the coronavirus the second it hits my face. You're still breathing it in. You're still, you're still taking it in your mouth and your nose. You're still gonna be susceptible to get it. So what I'm saying here is take care of yourself, do the right thing, wash your hands, wash your beard daily, keep clean. It's not all about what you put in your beard, it's how you take care of your whole body. So on that note, I wanna appreciate everybody that is watching my videos, liking my videos, the ones that are continuously watching it. Um, I, I really appreciate it, we're growing, we're getting there. Uh, I need to get to 100 subscribers. I wanna get to that 100 mark by Friday of this week. So that's in six days. Um, we got big things coming. We're gonna do freebie Fridays on, on Fridays now at 6 p.m. Central Time. 
I'm going to do all my giveaways. So if I do a video and I say, hey, we're going to do a giveaway, it's going to be on that next Friday. Listen to the rules in the videos. The giveaway will be labeled in the title. If I put anything that says giveaway on the title of my videos, there's going to be a giveaway. Um, we're going to do giveaways within the, the lives. We're going to talk. We're going to hang out. We're going to have fun. And the reason I'm doing that on Fridays is I don't want to eat up everybody's weekends. I don't want to sit here and say, hey, y'all got to come check out my live on Saturday. No, people got things to do on Saturday. But if we do it at 6 p.m. on Friday, that gives you time to get home. A lot of you on the East Coast especially get home, get your dinner in. You can sit down and, and watch while you're eating or, or right after you've eaten dinner, clean up the kitchen, whatever you're doing. And then you can have your whole weekend and I won't bug you anymore. I may post some videos during the weekend, but you got all week to watch them. Um, so go check out my link tree. I've got a whole bunch of affiliates. Uh, Beard Octane's got a sale going on right now, 20% off of everything. You use my promo code that's on there. You get another 15% off. I believe it's 15%. Don't quote me on that. Um, you've got all kind of other brands that you can get your, your 10, 15, 5, whatever percent it says on my, on my account. Just check it out. Go get you some stuff. I've got gear on there now with my new logo on it, my copyrighted logo. You guys go get you some stuff. Get you some stuff. Enjoy it. Um, the 4th of July sale for Beard Octane, though, ends, I believe, tomorrow. So you need to get on there quick. Um, they'll sell out of their stuff. You won't be able to get it. Something will happen. So don't miss out. Go get your stuff. Different tiers of stuff bought gives you a free gift. On top of that, I don't know if they stack. So I don't know if, like, you do one, you get one free gift, and you go to the next tier, you get both of them or just one. Um, but either way, it's free stuff. And then you get that big discount on top of it. So go check out my link tree. You can find it in my about section. If you're on a PC, you can find it on my um, banner. It's off to the right hand side, little green tree looking thing. All of my social media tags have them. Go check it out, get you some stuff, enjoy it. On that note, I wanna say goodbye. Keep watching my videos, keep supporting me. I'll keep trying to give you good stuff. Until next time, I'll see you guys around.